Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to create a date picker. So let's get started and see how to do it. First of all open your export and create a single view application. Click next. Give some name to your product. Make sure to choose Swift as the language. Click next. Create. And go to the storyboard. Here add a text field. Now place some constraints on this text field. You can keep 200 from top, 0 from left, 0 from right and keep 30 as its height. Now add these constraints and now create its outlet. Just hold the control key and drag it to the controller.shift file. Give some name to this outlet, connect, close it and open your view controller.swift file here get rid of all this extra stuff as it's not looking nice here now we will uh, create a constant for our date picker equal to UI date picker now we will create a function where we will set up our date picker or we can say where we will create our date picker right so create this function here first of all we will assign date picker to our text field right for that we will use date picker text field dot input view is equal to date picker right and now add this function in our view dot method okay now run this app so this is our simulator this is our text field and and whenever we click on this text field, it will populate a date picker here this way, right? So now uh, we will add a toolbar here and then we will add a done button on that toolbar so that whenever user click on that done button, it will fetch the uh, date details from this date picker and display it in our text field, right? So for that, we will first create a toolbar. let toolbar is equal to ui toolbar and use toolbar dot size to fit right now we will add add button on this toolbar let done button is equal to UI bar button item as we are placing this button on our toolbar so we will use bar button item here use this second option and in bar button system item use dot done target will be nil action we also keep nil for now we will set up set it up in, in a moment so for now keep it nil and uh, now add this button to our toolbar toolbar dot set items and pass this button in an array here turn button animate it make it true right now use this date picker text field dot input accessory view is equal to toolbar right so now run this app so now when we click on this text field it will populate our date picker and also a toolbar with the done button so currently on this on click of this done button nothing is happening 
so we want uh, whenever user click on this done button it will fetch the date details from the state picker and display it in our text field right so for that we will create a function for this done button right Funk done clicked right here use date picker text field dot text is equal to here we will use string manipulation this way we will pick the date from our date picker and set it to our text field right and after this we will end the editing cell dot view dot and editing make it to and don't forget to add this function here hashtag selector and use this done click function here right now run the app So click on your text field, select a date from date picker, click on this done button and now it's displaying the date on our text field. But its format is not looking nice, I think right? We want only to display date in our text field. So for that we will format, first of all, uh, as you can see, it's our date picker also showing time here but we want only to display date in our date picker and also date in our text field so for that we will first format the display of our, of our date picker format the display of our date picker and for that we will use date picker dot date picker mode is equal to dot date right it will display date only in our date picker and uh, we also want to display the format of our uh, text field display of date right so for that format the date display in text field right so for that we will use let date formatter is equal to date formatter right and now we will use this date formatter dot date style is equal to dot medium i will use medium as i like medium date style right and date formatter dot time style we will use dot no, as we don't want to display time here in our text field right and to display date with these settings we will replace this string with uh, date formatter dot string from date we will get it from our date picker date picker dot date right so now just run this app So this is our text field. When we click on this text field, it will populate our date picker with date only. So once user chosen the date, then he will click on this done button and it will display the date in our text field, right? So that's all about this video. Thanks for watching and keep coding.